Well, hello friends, Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to thank you guys for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, this literally does not work. Man, I am uh, uh, just about done working here. It's cleaning up, loading up the truck, and heading back home. Maybe I'll be home by 6.30, 7 o'clock tonight. See how much more work I can get done on that man cave, because we have tomorrow night the blue and white scrimmage at least that's what it used to be called mike mccarthy seems to be changing everything making us forget about the jason garrett era but um i'm curious about eagle fans eagle fans have been trolling the hell out of me i mean on a daily basis or should i say an hourly basis it used to be Eagle fans were on my channel before Cowboy fans were. It was like they were literally sitting at their desk at the keyboard just waiting to hit send as soon as I would upload a video, but I don't see them as much. I'm not trying to make light of injuries because I don't wish injury on any football player out there. But injuries are a thing you got to deal with, and it seems like the injuries are piling up on the Eagles. Um, interesting is Jason Peters, who was originally let go by the Eagles because they figured he cost too damn much money. When Dillard went out, the guard, they re-signed him to play guard, not the left tackle that he used to be. He's a, been a stalwart left tackle for years, but much like Tyron Smith, has been plagued by injuries, you know, just kind of keep getting hurt over and over again, and, um, you know, but when he plays, he's one of the best in football, so he re-signed to play guard, not his natural position, right now the Eagles, behind him, at tackle, they don't have a single tackle that has any game experience. Not a single play in regular season. So Peters, remembering that he was let go and then brought back only because there was an injury to play guard, now says he wants a new contract if he's going to play tackle. I guess he figures that, you know, I've got the Eagles over a barrel right now, and they don't have too many options at the moment. That's not a good thing. So, Philly, I don't know where you've been, Philly 500. You've been missing an action. You know, you grab the belt from a son, you know. You've been running around the house carrying the belt, and who knows what else you've been doing with that belt. You've been talking about my cowboys and telling me how much they stink. And that you're going to double moonwalk on that ass. we got to double moonwalk on that ass. And taking cowboy fans out one at a time. I'm just wondering, what the hell's going on around here? As you guys put it, you guys beat us with practice squad players. If the injuries keep happening, it may be that you got to have to beat us with practice squad players as well. Because your stalkers have been biting the dust. Come on back at me, Philly 500. I want to know what's going on, man. I want to know why you are so quiet these days. I miss you, dog. I miss you. Come on back around and let's talk. I'm Mark Holmes, and well... Looks like the storm has finally passed, the uh, tropical storm came through like gangbusters and now it's actually a little breeze blowing. It's actually damn nice out here right now. Whew. I wish I could click my heels and be home. Uh, crap. I'm Mark Holmes. And I'll see you guys soon.